was a real nice story, Bob. Thanks, Larry. And a great reminder of what's most important about Easter. Jesus! That's right. By the way, thanks for helping me get the egg open. You're welcome. I'm bummed out it was empty, though. Well, you shouldn't be. Why not? Because this is an egg that reminds us that Jesus' tomb was empty on that first Easter morning. <gasps> oh, I get it. Well, then I'm not bummed out at all. That's awesome. It sure is. Let's see if QWERTY has a verse for us today. And so what we have learned applies to our lives today. God has a lot to say in his book. I never get tired of that song. Me either. You see, we know that God's word is for everyone. And now that our song is going to take the look. Uh, QWERTY? Oh, remember, Bob? Cordy's got Sundays off. <gasps> That's right. Hold on a second. So, it turns out the golden egg was empty. No cream-filled bunny. That's okay. I've got plenty of jelly beans. Oh, jelly beans. I love jelly beans. Here we go. Mark 10, 45. For even the Son of Man did not come to be served, but to serve and to give his life as a ransom for many. The Son of Man is Jesus, right, Bob? That's right, Larry. Jesus came to serve us, even giving his life for us. And rising again on Easter. So, Timmy, does this help to remind you what's really important about Easter? Yes, remembering what Jesus did for us and trying to be like him. You got it, buddy. But we're still cool with the chocolate bunnies, eggs, and jelly bean thing, though, right? Absolutely. Oh, good. Well, that's all the time we have for today, kids. Remember, God made you special. And he loves you very much. Bye! Bye.